Hello and welcome to the Cranky Old Gamers Indie Spotlight. Today we are taking a look at Runers, which is a top-down, odd little roguelike with a fairly deep crafting system in that there are 285 spells, uh, an extensive bestiary, lots of... Uh, Let's see what else we got. We got the rune decks, all the different uh, runes that you can combine. It reminds me very much of Magicka, uh, but with more of a crafting aspect to it, rather than you already have all eight runes available and just combine them at will. Uh, like I said, you have a bestiary here. I've seen a few monsters here and there. Uh... I, the tutorials are very in-depth for something so basic, but oh well. You got your challenges. All right, so let's just jump right into it. First thing you're going to notice, you've got a lot of races, a lot of classes, and a lot of starting spells. That's kind of cool. I'm a fan of the golem. Uh, you've got your defense increase. Uh, I like the demonic warlock, although I never used his ability. I should do that this time. Got your, you can pick your starting element. It really doesn't matter. We'll start with fire. How's that? Oh, this has a very slow cooldown. My last one had much faster cooldown. That's okay. We'll figure it out. First room you start in never has any enemies. You're pretty safe. Uh, you can destroy boxes and stuff, but I, I very, very rarely, if ever. I don't even know that I've ever found anything in them. All right, here we go. As you can see, some of the enemies have projectile attacks, some of them are faster, some of them are slower. It's like Binding of Isaac meets Gauntlet. Ooh, got our first rune. I'm actually going to hold off on it, though. See if we can't find us some combos. Although, actually, no. I'll go ahead. Yeah, we'll get some Earth Spike. Eh, really not liking that one. But, oh, all right. Some of these rooms have specials. Can you win with powers reduced? Oi, alright. So I am heavily weakened. By these stupid rats. Ah, leave me alone. Wow, okay, so that was my special ability. That sucks way more than I thought it would. Come on, die, you stupid rat creature. Alright, so the, the earth spike is not that bad. Because it's a roguelike, I'm not quite getting the, the toys that I need. And because it's an Earth Mage, I don't know whose spikes are whose. Alright. Sweet! Alright, so we got a stasis event we can pick. Crit defense, 
an air rune, a fire rune, bullet speed. Let's get a fire rune. Ooh, and I leveled up. All right. Okay. Uh, minimum and maximum rune levels. All right. I don't get what this means. Oh, that's kind of cool. I like the Banshee Whale, though. We're going to go with that. you got a map here. You can toggle that on and off. I like having it on. Shows you everything that's in each room. Oh, I've never seen a Mind Mage before. Everything moves so damn fast, it's really hard to be any kind of accurate. And it is permadeath. Once you die, you die. Yeah, I'm gonna be honest, these, these abilities really kind of suck. I had a really good spell last time. It was an, it was an AoE. Uh, I combined air and earth and made a sandstorm, and I really liked that. However, I don't have any... In order to combine, you need combiners. And I don't have those. This is a stupid room. Yeah, see, I don't think these actually contain anything. There's no reason to blow them up, then. Unless you can use them as obstacles with enemies. I guess there's kind of strategy, but... Holy crap! I do kind of dig the skeletons. Because you actually have to run over them to kill them. You can't just... Otherwise, they'll keep coming back at full health. are nearly dead. So this might be a short run. We'll see. Okay, there's no... Sometimes you'll see an aura here, and that'll tell you there's some... Oh. Why is there a heart? Oh, I missed a heart. Alright, cool. Like, see, there's an aura. Is this... This must have been the starter room. All right, so we'll go up here. Now, what you're looking for is a set of stairs. Whether you want to take the stairs or not is up to you. I would recommend leveling up quite a bit. Oh, fucking burrowers. Like I said, very gauntlet. Ooh, what have we here? Alright. Ooh, heart. Cool. So the big ones contain stuff, I guess? I... 
I don't know. I got nothing. No? Nothing there? Okay. Holy crap! Sorry, I'm <laughs> kind of focusing, not really talking a whole lot. That's our... Don't mean to not be entertaining. I just don't want to die. Hi. Are you an enemy? Yes. Apparently you were an enemy. rat's nests. They are enemy spawners. Again with the gauntlet. Not that rats are all that difficult, but when you've got constantly spawning rats... spawning. <sighs> this is not panning out well for me. I am not finding any combos. I mean, in theory, I can take any one of these. What, hold on, what is this? Earth? And what is this? Is fire. Alright, well, I can do this and up my fire ability. But I have no combiners, so I can't make new spells out of these, which is very disappointing. As is this room. But now my fire is a little better. The bullet's bigger, it's going to do more damage. Oh, we've been here. Almost done. Hey, we got health. All right. And, oh, there's the stairs. Let's not go there quite yet. Because we're almost ready to level up. Uh, one thing that does kind of bug me is that you don't... And I know not all games do this. I understand. But I'm kind of spoiled by games that restore my health when you level up. And this doesn't do that. Ah, oh, crap. First things first, destroy the fucking obelisk thing. That's it. I, I feel like this game would benefit from more drops.
but we have fully explored this floor. Um. All right, we'll power that up a little. Anybody, please just give me something. Ooh, well, we're kind of becoming a fire mage, so... Uh, although, that's... Yeah, we're gonna... Not great. Yeah, I don't... I'm gonna give up on the whole blowing shit up, because that doesn't seem to help me at all. Hey. Alright. Come on, you little bastards. See, we're getting... Alright, we're getting more runes, which is good. Ooh, ooh, um... Is there, is there any kind of drop rate? Um... Fuck it, experience is always a good thing. And we've already found the stairs. I could, if I wanted to, drop to the next level. Um, I think that would be suicide. Ooh. Holy shit, these bats are... Sorry, rats, not bats. It's kind of hard to see when they're that tiny. <gasps> Got a combiner! Now I can actually show you how the game works. So we have one combiner. So what shall we combine? We have a speed rune and a raging speed rune. Well, let's find out. All right, so we can make a kinetic bolt. This, we don't know yet. What happens? Does it show? No. How about? All right, um, we're going to go with this because we have the most penitence. Oh, shit. Let's buff the shit out of penitence. Now, I can still use Earth Spike, but I would have to hit one or two to do it. Give it a cooldown, and... Okay, yeah, we like this. Now, if I just alternate the right and left keys, or mouse keys, we'll, uh, we'll be fine.
Yeah, this is much better. I'm doing a lot more damage. I'm just alternating right and left mouse button. Yes! <laughs> I don't know what magnet crawlers do, but... Alright, so we got another combiner. So what was this? This was mind and speed. We also have shock and light, shock and air. Let it cool down a bit. Ooh! Oh, I like this new toy. Oh, and it ricochets! Oh, this is wonderful. You know what, I'm just going to hold down the button, because that's frequently the best way to do it. <laughs> they make the weirdest noises. Ah, oh, thank god, health. Alright. Not really a lot of control over it, though. Alright, we have no more combiners, but do we have... We have some speed. We can give that speed. Alright, so we're doing okay. Goddamn floating brains. I hate them so much. may not have been readily apparent because it was happening so fast. The reason I hate them, they give you two tar targeting reticles, and you don't know which one's the real one. I gotta remember to use my, my racial ability. My skill ability. Whatever. And we're done. Alright guys, so this has been Runers. Uh, it's a fun game. I like it. It's kind of a nice little twist on the roguelike genre. Oh shit. Oh shit. I'm gonna die. The fucking mud golems are horrible. Alright, well, while I'm dying, guys, check out my Facebook, facebook.com slash thecrankyoldgamer. Check out my Twitter, crankyoldgamerx. And on October 25th, 2014, I will be doing my second annual Extra Life Charity Drive. Please tune in. The link is down below for the donation. Please donate. Everything goes to a wonderful cause. It's going to the Children's Miracle Network, helping kids to not die. Uh, what it is is for, you know, children. It's a hospital where the doctors care for the kids. And it's... If you've ever been into the children's wing of a children's hospital, they're trying to make it more kid-friendly. Like, they help them with... You know, if you've ever been a kid and you've been in the hospital, it's miserable. Uh, and what they do, they make it... You know, they paint the walls so that they're with cartoon characters and give them Xboxes and kids' movies to watch to keep their you know, them occupied. And it gets them the best care 
imaginable. So, it's a great cause. Even if you can only donate five bucks, that's fantastic. However, anyone who donates $25 or more will get to pick one hour throughout my entire slot of 24 hours, and I will play any game you want me to play. As long as I can stream it, as long as I own it, or you can get it to me cheap, I will play it. So... Alright guys, this has been Runers. Uh, check it out, it's a fun game, I dig it. And we will see you again with another Indie Spotlight. Bye bye